These things say to the these things said the Amen, which is Jesus, the Messiah, the faithful and the true witness, the beginning of the creation of God. That's who Jesus is, the beginning of the creation of God, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Verse 15, I know thy works, that thou art neither that thou art neither cold nor hot. I would that thou were cold or hot. So he's talking to the Laodiceans, the, the believers. He said, you guys, y'all just lukewarm. <laughs> y'all not cold, you're not hot. He said, I wish you was cold or hot. Be one or the other. Verse 16, so then because thou art lukewarm and neither cold nor hot, I will spew thee out of my mouth. Lord, I'm going to just spit you out of my mouth. I'm going to vomit you out because I can't stand you. You you, you, you want to say that you're a believer, but you don't want to act like a believer. You still want to act like the world and do what the world does. You can't do that. That's, that's hypocrisy. You can't just say that you believe. See, that's what Christianity is about. A lot of people say, yeah, I'm a Christian, but they're not a disciple of Jesus Christ. But see, Christianity says it's for everybody. It's not for everybody. It's for Hebrew Israelites of the seed of Abraham. So they get mad when you say, no, it's, it's, it's only for Israel, because then that takes away from their Christianity. Because Christianity says it's for everybody. And so that's why Christianity is anti-Christ. It goes against the word of God. But the Lord is saying, I want you hot or cold. Either you believe or don't believe. Don't, don't be half-stepping. So that's what they're doing in this church, in the church of Laodicea. The Hebrew Israelites of the seed of Abraham, they say they, they believe the gospel of the kingdom, but they're not acting like they believe the gospel of the kingdom. They're lukewarm. Verse 17